Okay, this one is called Why Does Nobody Remember Me in This World? The, the title itself is pretty lackluster, but the cover picture is a girl that's, you know, wearing some nice clothing and chained up to a pole. So I think that's why a lot of people are saying watch this one. Let's see it. Oh. Yeah, this is this is the reason. This this is the reason of all. If you look at Crunchyroll, actually, if you look at the trailers, right? Everything just got uploaded seven hours ago. Literally, everything just got uploaded seven hours ago. And if you look at the viewership, I think that yeah, this one has the most views because the fucking titties, dude. This this one has the fucking most views. <laughs> I mean, I mean, maybe there's more to the story than just this, right? Let's see it. Why is she tied up? Isekai? Keyblade? Crepe? Oh, of course, it wouldn't be fucking anime without a going on a date with crepe. I swear to God, this is like big crepe propaganda in Japan. There's something weird about anime dates where they always have a crepe. I swear to God, the big crepe industry in Japan has sold out. You know, I haven't sold out. The anime studios has been sold out. And they take bribes from big crepe industry. And every episode, they fucking put a crepe in the date so that you're incentivized to buy crepe, bro. We're like back on Earth, though, huh? I ain't gonna lie, this is... <laughs> I, I understand that you're trying to like, tell me that like, you know, she's in danger and like, I mean, it's called Why Does Nobody Remember Me in This World? So we're gonna like forget about her and this is her like disappearing, but like, come on, this is more funny and wonky than, you know, you're, like depressing, man. What the fuck is this animation? Come on now. <laughs> So it's like an apocalyptic world. I'm not sure if this is the future, but it looks like the girl disappears one day after going on a date and eating crepes. That's what you get for fucking buying crepes. And then, uh, post-apocalyptic world and nobody remembers the old world. Okay. And there she is. She changed hair colors too. She don't even remember the crepe date, man. All of that, all of that date for fucking nothing, and that's pretty much it. 2024 July, obviously, it's coming. The trailer itself is not good at all. <laughs> I mean, come on. I don't think, like, 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 this is like a first trailer, and I think they're trying to, like, tease at, like, what the story's about. And for that, I think they did its job. So basically, um, big titty blonde girl tied up to a pillar because, I don't know, a big black hole sucked them up, and then now we're in a different world, or, you know, the present world, but post-apocalyptic, nobody fucking remembered. He's the only one with the memories, and now it's our goal to, like, save her using this fucking glowing, you know, light sword we found in this scene when he was a kid. I don't know if this is gonna be good, but we'll definitely check out an episode, and if it does well, again, you know the rules. We do a shotgun approach to weekly seasonal animes. Whatever does well, we keep it around. What if it, you know, doesn't perform? We fucking drop it. That's it for me.